Hello guys and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm with a new Honda Civic Type R 2023 model and I have with me right here the new multimedia system from Honda and I want to show you how easy it is to connect your iPhone with this new multimedia system from Honda. So first of all guys you will need to turn on the car. Here we have, let me close this, we have the phone and I want to turn this, okay let me turn this off go to bluetooth first of all go to bluetooth and in the bluetooth setting you will see down here in this area where it's search for devices uh, you will go into menu once you go into menu you go smartphone connectivity here then you go connect new device and it will say it will give you also the, some information what you should do and turn on the bluetooth and down here it should appear honda hft okay and you can see it right here it says the same things then you press this one once and once you press it it will try to connect it will give you a pin also on the screen and then you will say pair once you press pair it will ask you you want to synchronize the contact okay synchronize the contacts then you will wait a few seconds you will see already it's synchronized and it, it's a read from the phone it will ask you you want to enable apple carplay and you, you can say yes and then you wait a few seconds and it should work yeah it will ask me one more time here use carplay and you just press use carplay and right now in a few seconds it should work come on all right in a few seconds you need a little bit of time to to charge it just like that and then you don't need any cable you can do it wireless so this is awesome so now the great part is that you can see it all over the screen it uses this apple carplay all over the screen on the all full screen and you have a lovely view so if you don't want to use that uh, navigation from Honda you can use this navigation from uh, your phone and it's very simple and for example you can use also the voice command you have this button here on the steering wheel you press it three seconds navigate to Paris getting directions to Paris France you can see how is this how cool is that and once it's load in you just press go and Starting it's route just to Paris. go and I want to see if you Proceed can see it stress, then turn left yeah this is it guys I mean this is it really cool huh what do you think about that really impressive and now let's go back to menu once you go into menu if you go left you can see all the application that you have it on the car and right here uh, you can see that you can use also the Google map if you don't like the navigation from the iPhone I have installed it Google map and if you go to Google map you can use Google map so this is also really nice Spotify WhatsApp Zoom Telegram whatever application even the news here you can see you have the news and all that uh, stuff that you have installed it on your phone so this is how easy it is if you want to go back to home screen of the Honda multimedia you just go uh, home here and you're back to home uh, and you can use uh, the navigation as you're supposed to use it normally but if you want to go back to the Apple CarPlay you just press this and you're back to Apple CarPlay it's that simple it's just super super simple if you want to disconnect it you have to go to phone if I remember well um, yeah or yes this is the uh, the phone or you have to go to settings let me I don't remember exactly uh, how you do that I think you have to go in the settings of the car somehow uh, I think you need to go a little bit more deeper in the settings around here should be maybe like that or not all applications general settings no those are let me go back vehicle setting no those are the, the most important settings in general settings here should be smartphone connection you go to smartphone connection you go to Apple CarPlay and you find here dance iPhone and then disconnect it's that simple it's super super simple and now it should be disconnected if I'm not wrong yes you can see it super nice super easy so guys this is it I hope you get some useful information from the video if you still have questions ask me down below from what I notice you cannot see the map here on the cockpit you know even though you can change different views I notice that you cannot see it and it, you can't get some 
uh, information there uh, on the screen. So yeah, that's been said. That was the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. I would really appreciate that. Thank you for watching. And I guess I see you soon in the next one. Bye guys.